British troops sent in 1768 on garrison duty, miserable garrison duty. Uh, fights break out in 1770, and this results in the British soldiers being withdrawn. They're sent off to New Jersey. 1774, after the destruction of the tea, British troops are sent back. Uh, the British fleet is sent to the harbor to garrison the town. And now the folks who live in Boston, the Whigs who live in Boston, find it an opportune moment to leave Boston. So the population of Boston really shrinks. Then after Lexington and Concord in 1775, the entire area is surrounded now by a Patriot militia. And this cuts off Boston from its supply of fresh food and firewood and the other things that are necessary to sustain, sustain life. So um, rations are poor, uh, food is poor, not enough firewood, they wind up knocking down buildings and um, chopping up church pews and other things. Because, you know, Boston gets cold in the winter. If you want to cook anything, you need wood, and you're shut off from the surrounding uh, supplies of good food and firewood and so on. You know, so it's a miserable place. The British are happy to leave in 1776. Um, and so as a garrison town, pretty bad place, a pretty bleak place, and the British commanders realized this isn't going to be a good place from which to win back the loyalty of the rest of the Americans.